working as intended. I didn't mean to. <laughs> <laughs> Day seven, but we won't have a base. Doesn't mean we have to fight in the middle of a field. That's all right. Let's make a platform. Just make a nerd pole. Go straight up. Mm-hmm. Enemies can suck my nerd pole. <laughs> yeah, we started working a little bit on a base. But it would really just be a spot to, like, I guess, place, uh, store items. Were we in the middle of an adventure? I can't remember. Uh, no, we were doing stuff on the base. I thought we left the base to do to start a tier four. Uh, oh yeah, actually, we cleared a area, and then we were going to start the mission right away. Yeah. I don't think you grabbed one, I think I just grabbed one. No, I think we uh, we both grabbed one. One of those was like south and one was southwest. Oh, okay. Yeah, so I, I think, think, I think we went just to... outside of mine then. But we, we emptied out the area, but we were ready to start doing the quest. Oh yeah, was that multi-level building? The one with the uh, what is savage uh, country on the bottom floor, and then you go down the elevator at the beginning. It was like commercial filler or something. Yes. <laughs> it's like, what does that mean? It means it's filling a commercial center, commercial block, and it's just a filler. I just have to remember to restart Steam. It seems if I leave it on for long periods of, periods of time, my friends list just freezes. <laughs> uh, we didn't quite finish. Oh yeah, we were. Before the room. Stopped in the stairwell. Yeah. Sent you an invite. Vulture baseball! To the elevator shaft. Loop. And there's a button here. Oh, it probably opened the door <laughs> that I busted down. I really need a button. There was a button inside here, too. I don't know what it's for. The, uh, there's a stairs out here that leads to a hatch and it should open that up. Top here? Yes. Whoops. Satellite dish. Uh, I don't see a hatch up here. No, like the hatch leading up to there. Oh, okay, I see, yeah. Uh, but, but there's nothing up here. Nope, we already got the big chest. The big but chest is on an earlier floor here. So why do we need to open a hatch to the top here? For the view. If we wanted to jump. Hi, zombie. Bye, zombie. <laughs> it's actually... Yeah, so this one was your quest, right? Yep. Safe to share it. Where's James? Sent him an invite. This one here is a tier 5. Why are you... I didn't, I didn't mean to. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, is that really keep, necessary? I keep inadvertently hitting the button on the side of my mouse. <laughs> it switches to him. But... Have James make his way over here. Yeah, and over here, James, we're going to go do tier four. Yep, trying to catch up. I think I have to share it again. I'm just doing a circle on his building, dismantling all the parking meters. I woke up enemies. Bonk in the shit out my frame rate. There must be lots of zombies here. Bonk. 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 Here's James. He made it. Bicycle gang. Yep. Next to wins, James can start wearing some armor. This is for the ladies. <laughs> Are we ready to start this? Yep. Ready? Surprise! Bonk! Yay keys! Open a, open an unnecessary door. You guys going to the basement? You go into the basement? Yeah. Where's this basement? It's from the elevator? No, not yet. Head in there. What do you want? I'm just filling my inventory with clothing. Get rid of all the clothing that's not best in slot. I'll meet you guys on the other side of the basement. The key. Hi guys. That's most everything down here. So smash stuff. 
none of your guys' business. Oh, you took out a desk here too. <laughs> <laughs> you took out both desks. The uni six side. You can go upstairs and take care of more business. Surprise! These guys are going clubbing. They're a screamer. Oh, with how much shit we're breaking, of course there'll be one. And she's angry! <laughs> Shortcut. Fog. These just go flying when they get smugged to the club. White power! There's a hardened chest hidden in the corner here. Find some rubble. Bolt your baseball! <laughs> and pick up the keys to open the door you just broke open. <laughs> Wee! Zombies are dropping down. Televisions. Tables. Dismantle everything. We still have angry music going. My inventory is full. <laughs> the way on is the uh, hole in the floor in the uh, wall here. Yeah, I was just checking to make sure there isn't anything. Your angry zombies. Hey, look up. <laughs> I like the submachine gun. <laughs> yeah, it's really good. Single player, instead of using the, uh, uh, the Desert Vulture now and, uh, with a shotgun, I use, uh, SMG and Sniper Rifle. And the reason I do that is if you finish off the Magnum Enforcer, uh, books, you start destroying stuff with your Magnum because the shots penetrate one enemy. Oh, yeah. It's kind of annoying where you start, uh, destroying lootable containers. So today's a day seven, so I suppose we should get somewhat ready for this. You grab everything? What was that? There's still an enemy somewhere. You can see the red dot. Is he down there? Or... I think he's up. I don't see him. Found the screamer. Oh, there's another screamer. Kill the screamer by blowing off its leg. Oh. Find it? Uh, James, come over here. No, wait, you're right there. Hmm. What's up? Well, I see feet sticking out of the, f the, f the ceiling down here, and I'm like one floor below James. They're moving. Can you see that? Look it up. <laughs> There's like a little crawl space up there. Weird. Hi, James. Hey! Alright, we cleared the area. It was bizarre. Dump stuff, turning quests, prepare for day seven. Sound right? Yeah, sounds about right. You're stuck! Yes. You cannot pick up until you end your inventory. Did you get stuck somewhere? Yeah. There we go. Thank you. Oh, I have to get over the parking lot. <laughs> oh, it's a bike lane, that's why. It's a bike lane with these curbs you cannot get over. <laughs> what distance, or what direction was yours? My quest? Yep. I think it was like in the opposite direction. I just want to see what direction it was for, uh... Picking a new quest? Yep. Suddenly these zombies just hanging out outside. Sweet. And a crispy zombie. There's still like so many different POIs that I've actually never done in this pack. <laughs> I wonder if Danger House's mob uh, enemies have respawned. Did you actually head out to the quest or are we going to actually start preparing? I went to drop off stuff at the base. Right, we haven't had uh, James come out, come out and uh, come to the base. Although I don't think it's good to fight at the base yet. I opened up that, uh, what is it, motorbike parts thing and gave me, literally gave me all the parts for the motorbike. <laughs> Need some nails. There's plenty of nails. Man, a lot of this stuff takes a long time to build. Welcome to the start of New Cube Base. I uh, see. <laughs> I'm working on a workbench. Can you start uh, building a. Oh, I guess you can't build a chem station. You need a workbench for that. You need a workbench for everything. What are you doing? 
There's a storm brewing. Look through the uh, boxes out here there, uh, James, and find some armor. It takes so long to build some of this stuff. Hey, Jay, did you make uh, any of those farm plots? Uh, no. I think I just put them in uh, one of the boxes. I was just using that for spacing here. I don't oh, plan okay. on filling this in yet because I want to get the uh, bottom here uh, steeled before I do cover it up. But uh, this 9x9 plot area, I figure we'll have a 9x9 plot area here on one of the other side, which we can have just farm plots. So we'll have 162 farm plots. That way we'll never go hungry. Wait, you can't one-shot dirt? No, with my regular. Don't you have any points in minor 69er? Do I? Care about it. It's like you're at level 435, you should literally have like all the regular skills maxed, because those skills are generally better than the, uh, the prestige ones. Oh, I went for prestige. <laughs> you want to make a forger three? Lower stone, duct tape, pipe. All right, workbench is just about done. This first night seven, I don't think there'll be too many enemies at once because we're still on low count, enemy count. So I think at the most we'll see is like maybe twenty zombies at a time. However, the horde, the zombie horde, uh, we have a, I have a mod that makes it last the entire night, so it's never gonna just stop. Oh yeah. Where are springs? We didn't loot enough beds. Oh, there we go. We have 641 springs. It's 18 o'clock. Three cooking pots. And 30 short iron pipes. Alright, where are our cooking pots? Should have had like three. Oh, Other wait. Yeah. And I saw beakers, so I'm just gonna make a chem station. Probably have more than just three uh, cooking pots, right? I don't know. Um, remember, I was putting some on the uh, cook fire before we moved the base, and I had a hard time finding them. Right, well, I have a grill and a beaker on this campfire. Uh, how many forges are you making? Uh, three. Oh, they should be done. Right, they, yeah, they should be on the. Put them on the back left or back right one, then I'll put the cement mixer on the other one, and that'll be good for the crafting stations. Back left or back right wall? From what direction? From north. From north or to north? From north, so southwest or southeast. On the first floor. Along the back here. We have a wall of protection! <laughs> oh. <laughs> We're probably not going to be fighting here. Because <laughs> we have no protection really for the base too much. And I don't want the up to get damaged. So probably like head, I want to say maybe just west. Should we head there now? What about it? West? To make sure I'm not driving into any of the random spikes you put down. <laughs> On the rock. I'm going to have to go a little farther than that. And there's a rock over here. There's two rocks over here. It's a tiny little pop tent over there in the middle of nowhere. Bonk. Start cutting down some trees. Increase our visibility. Remember to park your uh, vehicles a little ways away. You don't want them to explode. And yes, when bikes run out of health, they'll explode. It's because you keep lacing your bike with explosives. I think I might run as fast as I can bike. Uh, did you put a bunch of points into mobility? Yes. <laughs> what level is your mobi mobility at? It's like an 80. <laughs> I guess if you're wearing heavy armor, it helps a lot, right? Uh, I'm wearing light armor now. Guess I've got some heavy armor. Now. That plus the uh, parkour. I can like jump on top of buildings. <laughs> Is that parkour? Is was that prestige? And then I have 83 in range damage as well. <laughs> That's why the stuff explodes when I shoot with a shotgun. Should I add a skill where you don't damage contain stuff with your ranged weapons? Oh, that's fine. I actually can if I, if you want me to. Oh, no, that's fine. It's interesting. Please disappear. <laughs> Plus, I have used the shotgun just to bust down doors too. <laughs> Forty-five minutes left before the pain starts. Fill up your food and water. Oh, I forgot water. I have food though. 
Go on, some point. It's on the rock here. I keep running over towards James. It's like, that's the wrong way. Thanks, 27 bottled water. That was half of what I had. That's not counting the Yuka Juice and coffee and golden red tea. Uh, I should have increased my stealth so I can get the stealth bonus. Well. I don't think stealth works during the Night 7. They have uh, the feral sense. Uh, sometimes it works. I've had it work before. I mean, not if they're way off often. in the distance. James, are you going to come over here or not? Yeah, hold on. You have 15 minutes left. Only 15 seconds. <laughs> Shoot the rock below you, see if you destroy it. Mm. <laughs> oh, I heard a vulture right away. Danger music. <laughs> Spitty vultures. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's too many zombies. One got close. It's dead. <laughs> Cop! And cops dead. Ah, oh, they come from a different direction now. I'm crawling. I guess I took out some of their legs. Whoa, how'd you get up here? Cop. Fat dude, this. Yeah, first night seven seems really easy. I like my experience count at the bottom. It's like millions of experience. <laughs> Jason with a shotgun. Just hear you having the time of your life out there. Probably all have the time of our life out here. Boop! Did my sensors have picked up something? No shit! Disarmed. None of your business. Hehe. <laughs> M60! Murder! Run around and murder! His body just disappears. Not many zombies. Wee! Machine gun high, high popper! You know it's broken with running around with this uh, M60 as well? Is that every single time you like deal damage to enemy with it, you get your stamina back? Oh yeah. So how do you get stamina back? Is it's like, oh it's refreshing because you because you took out enemies, is that how it works? The enemies aren't running very fast, right? It's act they're actually jogging. Stay down. Had to repair my M60. White power! Oh, demos! It's like demos appeared about uh, game stage 150. Are we at 150? Yes, yeah, like 500. <laughs> demos are hardy though. So far, very non threatening. I'm just gonna get like more dogs yeah. and vultures. They're really the only dangerous enemies. Just because they're fast moving. Yes. I can actually get close to deal damage. Demo is in the distance. Three hours left. Experience counter was reset. It was too bad. I think we were getting up to like, what, six million? <laughs> <laughs> we're just like clearing a path farther down the street. Disarm. Weight power. And copper. Random bird's nests. I like it when you're like shooting enemies and they like they just die and then their body just disappears. Wide power. <laughs> Do we just juggle that one? Maybe. <laughs> Saw its head explode. The tree's in the way. They may be feral irradiated, but we're on the easiest difficulty, so they don't take much. That's okay. Once we clear this day, uh, enemies like uh, what is it, health and stuff and damage reduction is going to be increased significantly. It's like, shoot a zombie, body disappears. Yep. Yeah! Kill! 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 You die, and you die! Again! <laughs> Suddenly, Vulture. Boop! You dead? No, you're not dead. Now you're dead. <laughs> took down the tree with my gun. And then there's Jay's like, Rookie, I took down a whole house with my gun. <laughs> you know what's the hardest part about tonight? Trying to find zombies to kill. Here, zombie, zombie, zombie. Boop! 
Boop. Let's see which direction they're coming from. Still something in the southwest. I feel like there's like none coming after me. Like, will you just die, please? All right, 40 minutes left. I'm just running around and shooting enemies. Oh, I couldn't have moved into that one better. It's like cops put to my side. I'm like, I'm gonna strafe into it. I have plenty of levels tonight, too. Yep. 20 minutes left. Where's that vulture? I heard ya. There you are. You know, we, need to, we need to increase the zombies during the night. It can go as high as 64 per player. <laughs> Well, I think right now we have it at 6 from where our rolls are at. Daytime! We did it, we lived, that was easy. It was all a night clubbing we... for me. Alright, so our difficulty is going to increase to Adventurer. So that means like enemies gain like some like 25 or 50% more health. And I rolled a 13, so that means when you die you're going to drop your backpack. Alright, so next time, we don't even have to do base cleanup. Next time, I guess, keep working on the base and doing more adventures? More adventures! Oh. Thanks for watching! Hey folks, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to like, share, and comment. You can click on the left button to subscribe, and the right one to watch more 7 Days to Die roulette style. Thanks for watching.